Hello there, this is Red Joy, and this is uh, episode 7, I believe, for Hadrian, our Berserker, for Baldur's Gate Enhanced Edition. This is the uh, Insane Difficulty Hardcore Run. Let me double check. I better be it. Yeah, good. Yeah. yeah, I already changed the, yes. uh, fine tuned the difficulty. So, we're all groovy. Let's go grab that Wand of Ice. Femizia Edwin. All right. Shame we don't have anybody that can identify it, but we at least have it. And only because I don't want to have to come back, I'm gonna get the uh, special sword from uh, from, from Grey Wolf. Gun cross Grey Wolf and live. I am Grey Wolf. Right. And I think that'll help out. Oh. We are popular. Let's go ahead. Nope. No idea. Because your lore, your lore is 25, so it's reasonable, but it's not great. You are so irritated. It's done. All right. Hopefully, this will work out for us. Ah, oh, beauteous creature, you are my masterpiece. Uh, we'll guard you best we can. None cross Grey Wolf and live. I've come for you, Grey Wolf. I've come for you, Prism. I've come for you, Grey Wolf. Okay. What is it now? Eh, uh, crap. Try again. Who dares try TX? There you go. Easy peasy. Yes, soon. My work will be done. There we go. And I didn't get a reputation boost from it, which sounds yes. bad right until you realize that I'm with three evil dudes. So I'll take that. I'll buy that for a dollar. All right, let's go kill some uh, dragon rat things. I do wonder, in the original um, 2.5 edition, were kobolds actually connected to dragons? Because I know now they are, and it makes sense. Like, I kind of like the idea of that, right? Is that they're like the annoying little cousin of dragons? Like, very, very inbred cousin. But. So you want to take a look at me, Mom? I do wonder if. Uh, if that was kind of an intentional uh, change. Or if it was. Um, or if it was, had always been there. Very well. Stand away, citizen. Sunlight. One day, revenge shall be his. Dude, it's raining. There's no sunlight at it's all. Done. Moron. Oh, I'm so tired. Leave us be. All There's right. much work to be done. I know one of these has something. I know the one one downstairs has something in it. <laughs> I think I'm coughing up blood. All right. Yeah, we're not fighting demons. Alrighty. It's Let's done. boogie. Help! Help! It's done. I don't want to talk. Your worthless lives end here. You you targeted him. Nice 
So don't you want to kill the, uh... Did you guys want to kill the, uh... It's done. The miner? Oh, you know, I guess you got them, I guess. What go after TX? Why you guys go after TX? Uh... I don't have any potions of healing. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. I'm a dirty liar. These would be very useful. Hill giant strength. I need frost giant strength. That's what I really need. <sighs> Do you have a healing spell ready? You have a healing spell ready. Might as well use that. Nah, he doesn't need it. He can use it later on. Yes. A good day. Very well. There we go. I think back to my days when I used a short bow. Doing that precious 1d6 damage. Yes. So dark down here. Here's your dagger. Yes. Don't tell me. Oh, good. Okay. Good. They cannot stand against us. Strike. There we go. Alright, this is a good arrangement. A very good arrangement. Just have Kagan in the back hooking axes. He can go up front, it's just the problem is I don't have, like, infinite axes. And I just realized there is a limited axe supply in the game. <laughs> I win. It's done. Wonder. Nope. Hmm. We lack proper enthusiasm for our duties. TX demands blood and death. Oh, man. What <laughs> you want me to do? Drop kick a baby off a cliff? <laughs> That's a start. <laughs> TX will not be shunned. Yes, he will. Yes, he will. Okay. Actually, I just realized since I do have a limited supply of uh, axes. I'm gonna go ahead. I think there's axes over here. I think. Free for the taking. There's one. There's another. I know it sounds stupid, and it is stupid, but I've gone through, God, how many axes now in this game? Because <laughs> they just break. Like they had that line in Dune, may your blade chip and shatter. Yeah, that's a real thing in this universe. You cannot win this fight. Really? It's just really want to target Tx. Into the flames we leap. For not to have to heal him. Yes. For not to have to waste the healing spell on him. It's done. Alright. Just realized I forgot to turn on uh, thieving for him. Soon rules. Nope. Wrong one. There we go. TX 
Horses as TX does. <laughs> it's done. Yes. Extra healing potion for yours truly. Or for let's see, Kagan. Kagan has two. Right. It's done. I have a feeling we'll be needing those. You are so irritated. No. Don't I have also no I don't have it on this character. Okay. But that would be useful. Slashing attacks. Yeah, sure. There we go. There we go. Eat that, arrows. Again, you disturb me. Very well. <laughs> it's done. All right. Uh, I will also switch to throwing axes. It's done. And make sure that I am indeed on good. Prefer. Good. You know what? Why don't you just, just save us a bit of time? Thank you. Because they're just gonna keep coming. Look, when you're a cleric thief, you have so many abilities. It's done. No, don't you dare waste your healing on him. If you're gonna use healing, he'll uh, heal one of the frontliners. You cannot win this fight. Again, you disturb. I don't want You cannot win this fight. Okay. It's done. That's just silly. What is it now? Do you have any healing potions? No, you don't have any healing potions. You have a healing potion. Ah, fine. You know what? Fine. We'll just we'll just make sure everybody is healed up. Does that make you everybody so feel better? Irritated. Yes. There we go. Here's a tip: stop running into arrow fire. Just tip. What is it now? Just a tip. It's done. Roasty toasty. Again you disturb me. Yes. You are so irritating. Roasty toasty. Yes. Thought y'all were badass little mini dragons. Oh, I bet you. I bet you well. they're coming from behind us. Yes, here they are. Clever as they nothing. By the pits of hell. The darkness here is interminable. It is more than shadows. Oh it engulfs the heart and swallows. It's done. Okay, seriously. Yes. It's not cool for you to target my wizard. What is it now? Let's see here. Alright. Very well. Again you disturb me. Mirror image doesn't do a huge amount. Up, oh. pop up a poison. Let's increase those. Uh... Ow! Damn.
I probably could have handled this fight a lot better, but I'll be okay. Yeah, again, I could have handled that fight way better. <sighs> Do you even suspect what gem you have inadvertently discovered? Uh, Do I want to hear this? Do I try resting in this here location? TX moves. Make way. I think he's going to I think we're going to rest in the next area. Yes. We'll rest in the next area. Yes. Into the flames we leap. Why right. must TX traverse this dank hole? Nothing of saggy boots. All right, let's rest here. You do not dream often, but tonight the visions are vivid indeed. Long have you walked, but now you find yourself back amidst the stones of Candlekeep. Your former home looms before you, but the gate is closed and barred. Over the walls there is a candle in your old room, but as the light goes out, the brick surrounding the window closes together. The very walls conspire to keep you at bay. A familiar voice startles you. Though it is calm and caring, you cannot go back this way, child. You must go on. Gorion forms before you. And though his image should be comforting, it seems but a shade of his living self. He is dead in your dreams, as in life. The phantom of your foster father gestures toward the blackness of the wood, as though it should be inviting. Perhaps it is, in a way. But the traveling will be hard. As you think this, a smooth and obvious path becomes clear out of the corner of your eye. It seems meant for you, pulls at your very being, and promises to quickly lead you away from the life you once led. Perhaps this would be for the best, but it is a bit too convenient for your liking. You do not wish to dwell upon the loss you have endured, but neither should it be forgotten. Gorion smiles and fades away. The pull becomes a push, but you turn away. Steadfast in your new direction, the way is not quite as clear, but it is sure to be interesting nonetheless. A whisper follows as you stride away, something vestigial and sinister that you recognize, but yet have never heard. You will learn. You don't look back. Father? Father? Why are you not here, Father? Okay, put my watch on. Deal with the kobolds that probably interrupt us while we sleep. Little jackasses. How did I know that was going to happen? You cannot win this fight! I don't want to talk. Go past to someone else. These guys. Can you guys stop? At least you get a little gold out of it. And I can heal. Nice. Alright. There we go. It's done. All right. You are so irritated. And just to make sure, do I have another? I do not. So actually, 
these wands. Let's see here. 66, 5d6. Definitely do not need 66. Go pester someone else. Why me? Because you have a shield. There you go. Yes. Roasty toasty. That's the phrase of the day, I guess. Roasty toasty. I'm going to use that with my students today. Roasty toasty. They could be like, Mr. Is there something, something wrong with you? I don't want to talk. Uh oh, I yes. used. Use my real name. Alright. Yeah! Don't worry, I'll bleep out my real name. I think I've used it before in in these in these videos. So it's done. All right, what to what do about a now? boy named Malahi? First off, no. I know what you're thinking. You're like, why not use that? Because I want to sell it and then use it later for some for other stuff. Can you identify these arrows? Yes, you can. Way to go, buddy. Save me some space. All right, let's see here. What spells do you have that are... That's weird. It's very weird. Do haste. How long does haste last? Haste lasts one turn plus one round per level, and he is level level five. So my guess I'll be a nice, nice, decent amount of time. And then um, mirror image is how long? Five turns. That's really good. And then ghost armor is ten turns. One turn. Ah, that's what I want. An undead horde. What is it now? Potions do I have? Magic protection, regeneration, freedom, invulnerability. Saving throw is plus five. Else. Again, you disturb me. I'm probably way overthinking this fight, but okay, skeleton. I need you to actually be an adult and stay where you are. Actually, having everybody file into one spot is probably for the best. Very well. It's done.
But alrighty. You are so good. You hang back. It's done. I need an L. Actually, yes. if I help out here, then you boys right. should take no care of. What is it now? My actions are yours. They cannot oh, come stand on. against us. Strike them down. Alright. Again you disturb me. Couldn't uncover that chest, which is a shame, but say lobby. Okay, at least. Go to sleep. Nep, yeah, okay. Fight's good. Cannot win this fight! extra thing yeah don't need that one all right good job everybody way to go it is certain that the death of Malahe will relieve the fears of the terrorized folk of Nashkem but you remain uneasy while the half orc may indeed have caused the evils that befell the mine the shortage of iron is too widespread to be his doing alone his letters confirm your suspicions and though they give little indication as to where his cohorts are hiding they may have links to the bandits that currently plague the coast way. Alright. I thought there were some, uh, there they are. It's like, where are the arrows of fire? I like fire. Do we all? Yeah. Okay. All the unidentified crap. shame they don't tell you which letter you're supposed to read first, but yeah, what you gotta do, right? Alright. Uh, Edwin, actually, you go ahead and open this chest. Yeah, web. Sleep. Two fantastic spells. That'll go there. Short sword plus one. I will sell that junk. And potions of healing. Take one, and I'll take one. Groovy. All right. We did good, everybody. Well done. Pat on the back. Tidy that up real quick. I think a good question to ask is what level is a good level to actually do the Nash Cal Mines? Because it's like, on one hand, it's like, okay, well, it's done. You can technically do it at level one, but it's basically a 50 50 shot, right? Every level that you have after that, I mean, like the group level. I thank you for my um, friends, for I have languished. Every level after that, you're basically dealing with, it's done. like, like increasing your chances of success by a good amount. Yes. Right. Like if this, if these guys were all level two, I'd give them about a seventy percent chance of making it through. Seven out of ten times, they would have no problem. Level three, definitely ninety percent chance. This one was really not in doubt. It was just mildly irritating, right? Having all the archers always targeting, um, always targeting Edwin. Super annoying. You cannot win this fight all right
Did I? So I don't think I uncovered a whole bunch of these areas because I was scared about fighting ghouls. Still a little nervous, but with Potion of Invulnerability, it's not as bad. Really? Very well. Stupid. All right. Yes. Yes. There was a wand of uh, what's it called? Um, oh gosh, it was a wand of something. Uh, monster summoning. That's around here somewhere. I'll find where that is. And I want to check on my gold. Okay, gold is good. Gold is very good. Well, gentlemen. You cannot win this fight by the pits of hell. It's done. Almost positive I looted these, but yes, I did. Okay. Very well. Figure out where I had it's that done. wand of summoning. It's in one of these caves. Hi, handsome. Bye, handsome. Let's see. I'm guessing there's one over in this little area, this little pocket, but I could be wrong. Sorry, folks, don't have the maps memorized. And I was wrong. Thank you, Grace. I think you're wrong. They're literally trying to punch me with their fists. And they're still yes. more intimidating than monks. Just saying. I'm monks in this game. Actually, sadly enough, monks in just about every game. Okay, so. Yeah, no, I don't want any of this. Any of that business. I know full well that that guy is trouble. Yes, yes, go after Kagan. Into the flames we leap. It's done. I think this is the one I was thinking of. Hi, gentlemen. Soon, TX rules. You are so irritated. Who dares prod TX? They don't have much else. TX hears you. Yeah, don't have Soon much. TX rules. What is it now? Come on. Oh, that was silly. By the pits of hell. Come on. By the pits of Come on, hell. hit him. There go. Good boy. Yes. 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 <laughs> I've been looking for you. I have been looking for you. Well, uh, hold my appointments, Clarice. Because I'm going to get a nice belt. Why do I give it to you? Useless. Yes, that's right, folks. Edwin is indeed stronger than... Very well. Uh, Mr. Gnome. And a lovely, lovely wand. Very successful and lucrative trip. It's done. I'll take that. Very well. For a dollar. Take that for a penny. That was lovely. Wait, no. 
that doesn't make sense. I want to spend more for my success. Yes, that's what I meant to say. That's what I meant to say. Nothing else. Very well. Smart dogs. How's everybody doing on XP, by the way? Let's see. 29,000. I'm not going anywhere. 28,000. 2,000. Huh. 4,000. All right. So Very well. Very well. So TX and... Um, TX hears you. TX and uh, uh, Edwin. That's his name. Edwin. Are gonna level up. It's done. Relatively soon. Yes. Hello there. It's done. Listen, gentlemen, I don't want to interrupt anything. But I am going to stare. This is not entirely appropriate to be doing this kind of business. Here? Gentlemen. Okay, uh -oh. Leave y'all to your business. You know the barracks is right here, right? The garrison is right here. Y'all could do that. Gentlemen, come on. For the glory of arm. Yeah. Cash and experience. So now I think you're a little bit closer, right? Oh, right, because he's splitting it between the two. Who dares prod TX? I do. I want you to resist, cast resist fear on us. What is it now? You... Oh, gosh. Let's go speed this up. You two. I don't, know. I don't wanna talk. Put that away. It's done. Not that Hadrian really needs it. I mean, Hadrian's gonna basically do, uh, go berserk on this, uh, on this new skull. Come for thee. Surrender. And thy passage shall be quicker. Why I have been tasked to deal with this. Only I know. He acts here. Again, you disturb me. Right. You are so irritating. He so might get off his grows. spell before I do, but. Stand away, citizen. So I'm berserk right now. So I'm probably screaming at this guy. I am Adrian! This is my band of fellow adventurers! I hear this is a troubled region as of late! <laughs> I don't know if I envision his berserk being quite that aggressive, but... <laughs> they might implement a rule in whatever patch they want to to say that if you are berserking dialogue's gonna be a little harder for you <laughs> what things aren't good <laughs> screaming in the face of this guy as he's crying over the loss of his companion of his captain oh <laughs> uh, inventory management, always fun. I don't like how this place feels. It is as if we are being watched. You you know this is not gonna end well for you, right? Do not have time for proverbs right now. Can you even carry more axes? Can he carry more axes? How many more axes can you carry? A great spell for when I finally become a wizard.
You can carry more axes. There you go. What a champ. What a champ. Alrighty. Topsiders Crutch. Senses of the Cat. Ah, that's gotta go to him. And take that too. Okay. Well, guess what time it is. I'll get a pod some good stuff. Welcome to my humble establishment. I'm gonna pawn some of this stuff. Mr. Red Joycer, uh, you've used that joke several times. I'll have you know that that comes from the game Diablo. You are correct, sir. Um, I do not know if I have to sell this at a particular, sell the wands at a particular place. I already have a nice... Do I sell both long swords? Yeah, I do. Alright. Very exciting Very music well. for the, uh... Very well. Okay, so... We're gonna go to sleep now. Oh! We didn't take care of you! Well, crud monkeys. I guess we're doing that now. Huh, <laughs> bad timing. They, oh, oh, that's not good. Cause disease. Uh, that's not a good spell. That's a really bad spell. That could kill me. Cause disease. Uh, saps 5d4 strength. Oh, I see. Okay, so that could have killed me outright. Uh, let me read the rest of the spell, because that seriously could have just killed me straight up. So, uh... A uh, spell afflicts one creature touched with disease that saps the target of 5d4 points of strength. A successful save or spell negates the effects. Okay. So it could have, it could have killed me straight up, but... It did not. So, we're gonna have to be careful of that. Um, and it only lasts for X number of turns. Again, you disturb me. Soon, TX rules! Yeah. Okay. Yes. I cannot move. Nope. Eyes of Truth. It's actually going to be very useful for me, but I cannot move at the current moment. Uh huh. Well, shnikes. Okay. No, you can't move. But. Very well. Never had rest. Let's see. You were startled out of sleep with a chill, though the night is warm and calm. It is though someone has walked across your <sighs> If the music's gonna screw up the immersion, moment, you wonder, then I don't feel guilty about screwing up the immersion. With this thought, the ground beneath you opens, and you are swept into the dark. When light returns, you do not find its presence comforting. Before you lay the empty minds of Nashkel cleansed by your previous passage you move through walls and floors alike <laughs> this is a super dramatic scene 
Jesus. Game, come on. Stop screwing it up. <laughs> come on, fella. <sighs> Papa Redjoy is not satisfied. Had this creature breath, you were sure it would be hurling curses. It waits for the kill, a death beyond death, mm. and knows no hope. You turn your back on the blade, and it clatters to the floor. Punishment enough shall find this creature in the land of the dead. You need not inflict any more upon him. Surprised and thankful, the visage of Mullahe hobbles forward and through you, off to whatever fate it deserves. Perhaps for safekeeping, it leaves a part of itself behind. Ew. It is a spark of hope that fills a space within you. Don't want it though. The shaped hole you did not know was empty. There is a cry of rage from the depths, and the dagger of bone launches itself through the air. Your heart, its target. Ow. You awake just as it should have struck, and the cold sweat that covers you stings your eyes. A disapproving voice lingers in your ears. Though it should have disappeared with the dream, you will learn. Apologies for the uh, disruption. Okay, music, you need to figure out what the hell you're doing. Come on now. All right. We're back to normal. Yeah, cure disease could have straight up killed me. Um, 5d4. It's done. Strength damage. 5d4 Very strength well. damage would have done... Uh, Let's see. Ah, uh, it would have had to roll. Okay, to be fair, it would have had to roll perfect, uh, or near perfect rolls for all of them. Because if I if this goes down to zero, I do die. So very well. Uh, that would have been bad. Okay. All right. So first objective: get the belt. Yes, that's right. Going to high hedge. Very well. Getting the belt. Belt to the badass. Try not to get struck by lightning on the way over. Oh, did I break a weapon? No, I did not. I was just holding one max. And you didn't break a weapon either. Very well. Yes. Montiax. Why do I live in such a pissant town? All right. All right. So golden girdle. Okay. So by the way, as a quick reminder, this is part of the Thalantir items mod, right? Where he can make items for you. Uh, and I believe my Gideon run had this as well. But uh, golden girdle, girdle of bluntness, and girdle of piercing. You get an item that will not disappoint you. He also needs. Potion of Frost Giant Strength, Potion of Cloud Giant Strength, a Potion of Regeneration, and 5,000 Gold. Yes. It's a Girdle of Bravery. Of course, he also has to identify it for me. You jackass. Oh, it's already identified. It's already identified. All right, here we go. Strength plus one bonus. Nice. Regenerates one hit point per second. Armor class plus three bonus. Hells yeah. Hells yeah. Look at that. Look at that. Yeah, Thacko goes down to six. 19 strength. Hells yeah. Hells yeah. All right. Now we're cooking with gas. A shame about you guys, though. Say lovey, you'll live. Um, what else? Oh yes, okay. So step two. Yes. All right. So step two is let's do wand shenanigans, right? So I'm thinking if I sell wands to this Joe, he will um he'll give me um. 
he'll give me versions of of the ones that have that are fully recharged so it's kind of what i'm thinking so we're going to sell this yeah okay so this one will be fully recharged i believe with like several th uh, like a hundred uh castings of it yeah but it's a little pricey for me right now as useful as it would be and we got this item this stuff here let's see talos's gifts don't need that chainmail plus one don't need that do i want to take the eyes of truth i do wand of frost Wand of Frost would be useful for Bobos, random Bobos that I don't that have like a gem on them. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna do away with that. Good direct damage ability. In fact, I'll replace that with that. Um, oh, you do need a helmet, but I think you already have him for vision. So I'll take that. You take this. There we go. And. Rejoy plays with his inventory. Okay. And the question is, do I sell my wand of fire? I think I kind of need to. Tell Minster that. Give me two thousand years and the pointy hat, and I'll kick his arse. Yeah, tell him that when we talk to him. All right, so let's see how much this is. Oh, jeez, okay. But well worth it. Well worth it. We just need to get 27,000. That's never going to happen. Okay, but that's okay. Uh, Wands of Fire are pretty easy to come by. But at least we have a backup if we can get enough money for it. Um, no, that's silly. Level four, level three. It actually is a pretty good spell. So this and this. I believe, actually, I believe that invisibility, how long? Duration. Okay, let's see. Special duration. Um, visible creature is not magically silenced. Items drop. Okay. Da -da. Cannot perform any actions. Manipulate the environment. Okay, the spell remains in effect until it is magically broken or dispelled until the recipient attacks a creature or until eight hours has passed. So just keep that in mind. In the mod that I have, um, it shortens the, the length. Invisibility normally lasts for like 24 hours. It's an illusion that I care at all. Very well. Um, it very is well. a very good spell, but it's also one that... Um, It's also one that, that is it now. it's done is limited in this version that I have. Great pickup for a sorcerer though, because the sorcerer they could just straight up be like, you cannot win this fight. Go in there. Very well. It's done. All right. Yes. Very ghost.
You're not talking to Hadrian, you're talking to the ticked off dwarf. Who's tossing money? I've worked in I've worked in Barakos my entire life! Where's the jovial juggler? I don't know! Ah Kagan. There you go. Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna chat with Elminster. Stay thy course a moment to indulge an old man. And then we're gonna go. Sell some scalps. Can I assist you? Can I assist you? Buy my scalps. Yes. And yes. then from there we're gonna get ready to take out Mage Gillicuddy. If we accidentally kill Algernon on the way, well. Let's just say accidents happen. Did we already get the cloak? No, we haven't gotten the cloak yet. Look, accidents happen. I can't... I can't guarantee that accidents don't happen. I can't prevent them. Sometimes when magic is... like how this place feels. Sometimes when magic is, is uh, incorporated and blasting all around, you just don't know what's going to happen. But I know what is going to happen. We're wrapping it up for today. I know very sorry about that but if you like what I do you know what to do leave the video a like comment subscribe to the channel make me some you know imaginary buckaroos because <laughs> this move this channel is not making money anytime soon but it's fun to do and I love working for you guys and doing this for you guys so with that take care and good luck we're all counting on you